Hi guys, today we're going to work on knee pain. I'll show you how to use the Itera Care wand on knee pain. So I know a lot of people are using it and some people are getting results and some people are not. I'm going to show you guys how to get results with this thing, right? This is an incredible tool. Um, and let me just say, if you guys have been watching my videos, you know the power of energy healing. I'm showing you guys, I'm demonstrating, I'm telling you guys stories and things that I've seen happen with my eyes, right? When people have a problem and they feel that they're broken for life and that they have to just cope with that problem, right? And that there's no solution. Uh, guys, energy healing has uh, solved all kinds of problems, right? And this is what I wanna teach you guys, how to help your body to heal. You wanna start a healing journey if you haven't already start a healing journey get into you know practicing um you know healthy living and you know uh, releasing of emotional trauma and baggage and mental um mental baggage that is holding you back so guys i'm going to teach you guys how to do this now when it comes to uh when it comes to pain now we're not medical practitioners if you're having pain anywhere in your body you want to get it checked out by a doctor however if you're dealing with pain and uh, you're on medications and they're not working or if you're trying to get off your medications uh, energy healing could help you to rid yourself of pain or to help you to reduce pain right now pain in the knees I have helped people a number of people guys who thought who were told that they have uh you know all kinds of of different uh problems with with their knees arthritis and uh bone on bone you know rubbing and this and that guys uh pain starts from pain originates from the brain and not that local area this is the reason why uh patients that had amputations where they had their entire an entire leg was amputated they still they still feel um feel pain right and this is the reason why pain is generated by the brain and not the the actual area right so if, if you don't have a leg and your leg hurts what does that say right so guys um I have gotten very good at helping people with pain. Um, I, I, I don't know what it is, but I focus on pain and I use my intuition to guide me to see what is the root of this pain. And, you know, in all cases, they are energetic root causes, right? I had people who could not walk because they had knee pain, they could not work because of knee pain right and that knee pain is basically uh, trauma energies imbalancing an organ and the organ that is uh, usually associated with knee pain is a gallbladder this is a reason why um, why a lot of people with knee pain or shoulder pain they have issues with their gallbladder right they would have um, they would have some of them would I mean, without me even knowing when I'm working on them, I would say your, your gallbladder is imbalanced and that was causing the knee pain. And uh, well, after working with them for like a number of sessions, uh, some of them even after one session with me, no more um, knee pain, right? And when I ask them, when I tell them about the gallbladder, they're like, I don't have a gallbladder. So do you see guys? these these energies these these uh trapped trauma energies cause issues for us and what if we didn't have these or what if we release them prior to surgeries right could this prevent surgeries i believe so guys trauma is something that we don't pay attention to but this is a solution to 
you know, almost every health problem you have. And our Western um, medicine is, is not geared to address this. We're under so much emotional stress and there's no, no one is talking about this. No one is talking about the root of diseases, right? And what we can do, no one is talking about what we can actually do to fix ourselves. There are ways to prevent problems before this, they happen, right? So guys, knee pain, what you're going to do is you're going to turn it on to the lowest set. I, guys, I, I'm telling you guys to use this lowest setting because I don't want you to burn yourself. But sometimes I would go for the highest setting. And uh, this has three settings. The number two is the lowest setting and it's the cold setting, right? So you're not going to uh, burn yourself. The highest setting uh, gives a deeper penetration. So you're going to you're going to feel a, you know more intense healing with this because it could... Uh, it could this this here is pretty good when it comes to like penetrating um anything like like any glass or uh your clothes or the skin or bones and it gets in there right so you want to use the lowest setting and then you're going to um you're going to direct the energy the frequency to where where are we to the gallbladder so above the belly area, you know, above the, the liver, you're going to direct the energy to the gallbladder. Just focus on this area here, um, the right side, the right side. And keep the, the wand there for 10 to 15 minutes and do it every single day, right? Every single day on this point here. And then um, when you're done, right, because we want to get to the root of these problems, guys, you don't want to be spinning out wheels and then you, you end up not, it, it, you feel like it's not working and then you end up, you're like, this doesn't work. It, it does work. It does work. If you get to the root of a problem, it, it has no other choice, but to the, your body will release the pain. It will release the symptom. So you get to the gallbladder and you uh, focus on that for, you know, 10 minutes or so every day until you start seeing improvement until it's completely gone completely gone if the pain is a little bit if it's not 100 percent gone it means that your body is still telling you that there's stuff there right um so you want to continue until it's completely gone so when you're done with the gallbladder then you're going to do directly on the knee itself okay because when it, it creates a subconscious link because um, your subconscious mind wants it wants uh, satisfaction. It wants to know that you are you care. You're you're addressing the problem, right? Even though the knee physically may be okay, it doesn't matter. You know what? If if you feel you had an injury, stop with the stories, guys. Stop telling yourself my knee hurts because of whatever because i fell i injured it because the doctor said this because um you know <clears throat> whatever because i had a diagnosis because i had this pain for so many years it will never go away this pain is stuck with me i'm never going to be able to walk i am helpless i can't uh, do the things i wanted to do stop with the stories right because these stories are keeping you stuck right you want to change these negative beliefs and thoughts and start with that start with that so by directing the energy <clears throat> to the heat the uh, knee itself that's going to tell the, su the subconscious mind that yes you are addressing it that's what the subconscious mind wants right it just wants to know that you are addressing the root problem guys right i have a lot of experience with this this is how it works and you're going to be okay get out of this negative zone so guys that's it for knee pain make sure you access the full guide on other problems i'm going to talk about on how to use this thing okay this is an incredible tool and you guys should get one and the guide is going to have information on how to order also so guys i'll see you in the next video